Hello everybody and welcome to the Great Zaro Gaming Channel. This is Farming Simulator 17, a little game I've liked to play for, for a while now. I'm uh, just blowing the dust off of it and figured I'd break it out and give it another shot. Maybe do a little series on it. Uh, I do apologize for being gone so long. Uh, I've actually started school um, and that has taken every ounce of my free time. But I'm going to start trying to upload again and uh, try to get some of these videos out to you guys. So let's get started. All right, what we've got here, I've got a uh, map that we just started. All I did was load it in and saved it. Uh, I did adjust some of the settings on it and things like that, but uh, other than that, it's pretty much just like it is out of the box. So, let's see what we got here. All right, we've got a combine. Hey, and we've got a field to harvest, it looks like. Got a tractor and a cultivator tractor and a planter or cedar how whatever you want to call that a tractor and a uh, little small wagon and a truck and of course the trains all right so well for starters let's go ahead and harvest this field so let's attach this unfold the harvester turn on the harvester and let's get rolling This is one of those relaxing games. It's, you know, not really anything you have to do really fast. Just kick back, do what you want to do, enjoy the ride. Uh, hopefully it won't be too boring for the series. Uh, what we're going to go ahead and do here, I'm going to go ahead and hire an operator to handle this task. And then I'll switch over to this tractor and we will attach the wagon that way once he is full we can go in and harvest and uh and harvest well i think we're harvesting already but <laughs> we can go in and let him unload so let's check and see what we've got here real quick ah, i always hit the wrong button uh, let's see here we go all right here's what we've got in the silos already you start out with a little bit um, guess kind of give you a head start so it looks like these prices are dropping all right well still still potential still potential so we have to decide what we're gonna plant and I've never really given it much thought. I just in, in this game, I just pretty much plant whatever I feel like planting, um, and go from there with it. All right. So while wow, this guy makes his rounds, we're gonna skip around a little bit. I've got the time scale set it. Well, right now it's set at one x. Uh, let's bump that up a little bit. I want it to be a little more realistic. Um, because you can get a lot done with it measured that way. So let's put it on 5x. Maybe that'll be a little bit better. Uh, to give you an idea of what kind of settings we've got here. Plant growth fast. Uh, fertilizer states 3. I put it on that. Uh, makes it where you have to fertilize 3 separate times. Uh, during the growth stage or before planting or you know all of that good stuff. Uh, to get full yield out of your crops. I just increase the difficulty a little bit. Plus give us a little something more to do. Because the beginning parts of this are a little bit slow. So here's something else we're going to do. While this guy is doing his thing. We're going to go ahead and hook up the cultivator. and go behind him and start cultivating this field. Since I don't have a way to get the, the straw up, we'll just cultivate that in. Let's 
kind of help us see where we're at too. pretty slow process I usually automate most of this by hiring workers but sometimes like if I want to keep an eye on something or whatever I'll go ahead and do it manually helps add a little to the immersion really it would be best if we had a plow I believe uh, if I'm not mistaken I think the plow actually helps with your fertilization state There I go hitting the wrong button again. Let's check that map. See, uh, not fruit types, growth, uh, soil composition. That's it. All right. So right now we're grayed out. So pretty much we we have nothing. So it's not no no stages of fertilize you know fertilization I should say. Making up words as I go here. <laughs> Or ways to use words. So we'll have to figure out a way to fix that. Start off with twenty-five thousand dollars. I hadn't bought any equipment. I hadn't done anything. We're just using what we've got. Normally, the first thing I do is I go severely in debt I buy a bunch of equipment um, all that good stuff and I'm gonna try doing things a little different this time we're gonna try letting the farm pay for itself instead of trying to take out a bunch of big loans may be realistic may not be realistic we'll just have to see when the time comes it's gonna make it a lot harder to progress but um, I've never tried it this way before, so it'll be interesting to see what happens. Uh, he doesn't have his pipe out yet, so we know he's not real close. Hopefully I've got my volume level set right. I'm noticing my game volume looks like it may be a little bit high, but hopefully everything pans out. If not, I apologize and I'll fix it in the next video. By then I'll know. I'll be a, uh, I'll have watched the the uh, <laughs> the video for this one. I did a little trial run with an, an older save game. Hopefully I've got it pretty close. Normally I have a bad habit of the game volume is too low. Um, so you can't really hear what's going on. Kind of takes away from it a little bit for me anyway. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Um, if the game volume is a little too high, let me know. I'll drop that down. Just drop something in the comments. Also, let me know what you think about this game. Uh, I know there is a new version out. I believe it's 2019, 2018, 2019. I'm not sure which. Um, a farming simulator. Um, let me go know what you guys think of that one. I've thought about picking it up, but I'm not sure how much different it is from this one. Um, I owned the version before this, and then this one, and uh, there were some, some different things, but I'm just not sure if it's worth the money to spend, you know, if the, if the gameplay experience is pretty similar. Uh, curious to know what you guys think about that also. Uh, so leave me any input uh, that you've got on that. I thought about thought about buying the game, uh, the updated version. I just hadn't talked myself into it yet. All right, trucking right along here. He still didn't have his pipe out, so he's still not 
close to being full yet. But let's go ahead and automate this task. Whoop. Swap over. Here we go. Let's go ahead and unload him and see how much he does have. Ah, they're going to clash. <laughs> All right, so let me go over here and cancel this worker. There we go. And let's see. Hmm. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> I can't remember what it is to toggle between the uh, between the cultivator and the tractor. Hmm. Okay. I gotta look this one up. Gotta look this one up. Yep. Nope. 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 Bunch of nope. It's in here somewhere. I'm telling you, it's in here somewhere. <laughs> uh, okay, maybe I'm telling you wrong. Maybe it's not in here somewhere. And now he's ready. Yeah, I'm not really sure which one does that. Oh, we can do it that way. That way you can, uh... That's right, if you get out of it... Okay. I was trying to think of how to turn the tractor off, but if you get out of it, it automatically shuts off, so... <laughs> Uh, just wasted much time. Can you tell it's been a little while since I played this game? Anyway. We are going to let this fella unload here. Let's see how much we got. Another thing I'm going to start doing in my videos also, uh, I used to I, I used to usually do a lot of editing on them and uh, cutting out a lot of the a lot of the mistakes and a lot of stuff like that. Uh, I think from now on I'm going to try to do as little editing as possible. I don't know, keep it real, you know, leave all the <laughs> all the stupid parts in there. Um, maybe you guys get a laugh out of it, you know. But uh, yeah, a little less editing sometimes makes it. Ooh, that's loud. A little less editing sometimes, you know, makes it a little more interesting. Uh, like this. Going the wrong way. <laughs> Let's try that again. All right. Let's go over here to our silos. Yes, I know. The silos of temporary storage of your commodities. Drive over the unloading spot with a full trailer and unload its contents. Assemble the display to the right as soon as you are in position to start unloading to retrieve a commodity from storage. Position the trailer below the pipe on the other side and activate it. The trailer will be loaded until it is full or until the storage is empty. For those of you that's never played before, it, it is a very uh, addictive game, I will have to say. All right, we'll unload here. There we go. We have unloaded. Park our tractor back over here. Now let's switch back and go ahead and hire this guy back. Maybe the harvester will stay a little ahead of him. All right, and let's attach the planter or the sower. Okay, this one is ready to sow, it looks like. Uh, we're full of fertilizer, we're full of seed. So, 
Now we just need to select what we're going to plant. What should we plant? Hmm. Let's let's hit the wrong button again. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see how well everything's doing. Well, next off, let's see what we got. Okay, yeah. So there's no fertilization on this field either. <coughs> okay. A few prices going up, a few prices going down. I normally don't pay a whole lot of attention to this. I usually just look at how much of everything I have. Uh, corn is not really an option right now because we can't harvest it. Potatoes and beets, same thing there. Uh, hmm, I'm not even really sure what this is. Interesting. I have to look that up. Um, wheat, barley. I believe it's wheat and barley. And then canola and sunflowers. Sunflowers I don't think are an option either. I think you've got to have the special header for those. Soybeans. Um, not really sure. Not really sure on what we can harvest with what. Um. Harvesting. Here we go. Maybe this will tell us. Eh, it doesn't really. Okay, root crops. Cultivated potato sugar beet, specialized soil machine and harvesters. Okay, we knew that. Old seed radish. Special crop. Uh, you don't harvest it, but you dig it in. Once the plants are visible, you can use a cultivator on the field. So-called green manure and works as fertilizer, increasing your next yield by 30%. Okay, oilseed radish. Oilseed radish. I wonder what that looks like. Maybe that's the one that we saw on there that looks strange. Um, so, select seed. Would that be the oilseed radish? Or is that beets? Interesting. Okay. Interesting. All right. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This tells us sugar cane. Okay. That's interesting. Sugar cane. I didn't know that was a thing. I've never paid attention to that before. Okay, oilseed radish. Yes, that was right. So, let's try planting some oilseed radish and see what we have to do to turn that in to help with the, the crop production. Because if I remember right, I think that uh, actually helps you with, uh, I believe it's 30% uh, better crop yield. I think that's right so in that case we're gonna plant some oil seed radish here we're gonna hire a worker and let him do his thing and he is planting away all right let's go back over here and check on our combine or harvester I should say he's still doing pretty good still got a little ways to go I just wonder with the oil seed radish, do we have to plow that in, or can we use the cultivator to turn that in? It'd be interesting to find out. We might have to buy a plow. We'll have to find out. It'll probably be the next episode before I get to that, I'm sure, but uh, it'd be kind of interesting to find out. Let me go ahead and unload this guy. That way we know he can finish the field. So if I get sidetracked in something... Uh, he still gets to do his thing. Pull up next to this guy. He'll go ahead and stop and run his uh, 
Pipe out. Whoa! So much for stopping there, big guy. Let me turn away from him so it's not quite as loud. <laughs> hey, had a pretty decent amount on them. That's good. All right, there we go. Now let's get out of his way so he can do his thing. cultivator is getting ready to be in the way of our harvester so let me go ahead and stop him again all right we'll come back to him later I guess really the next question with the oil seed radishes is, is it really feasible I mean is it Okay, you have to spend the money on the radish, on the seed, you know, you know, putting it in the ground, all that good stuff. Um, but is it really worth it in the end? You know, do you make that money back? I'm sure it's using fertilizer also, so you're buying fertilizer, you're buying the seed, you're paying the worker to do it unless you do it yourself, which I just don't have the patience with the smaller equipment. Once we get into the bigger equipment, yeah, I run that a lot of times, uh, but the smaller equipment just seems to take forever to go through a field, so I usually turn that over to hired workers. But is it worth it? We might have to do something to, to test that theory. You know, do a field with and without. Um, see what the difference of yield is. Go from there with it. Be interesting to find out. All right, he's getting close, so we can go ahead and hire this guy to do his thing again. Okay, buddy, you got a long ways to go. A long ways to go. All right, so what we're going to do here, we're going to go ahead and take over the combine. Since he's almost done. Let me zoom out a little bit here. We'll finish getting this last little row. Not a bad haul. For free. Yeah. I say for free. We spent almost $1,000 uh, between planting the other field and harvesting this one and preparing it for the next planting. So, so yeah, still, we might as well say it was pretty much free. All right, and we are done. So we'll turn off the harvester. Pipe out. And unload our grain. hop out of there oh, while this guy does the rest of his stuff we'll go ahead and dump the rest of the what we got in the trailer here
and unload. All right, so we are done with the harvesting for right now. So we'll plant our plant our <laughs> we'll plant our tractor in here in the shed. And hop out of it. It's always good to plant your tractor. Just make sure you plant your tractor. So. <laughs> Alright, so we almost have another field ready to go. So, this guy's got a long ways to go. This guy doesn't have very far to go, so why don't we go ahead and take over for him. Yeah, see, it's still 8.55 in the morning. There is no way we would have harvested a whole field and it'd still be 8.55 in the morning. So, yeah, I may adjust the, the time settings a little bit more. Make it a little closer to realistic. At the same time, I usually bump them up whenever, you know, once I get everything planted and all that good stuff. Um, it's a long wait in between in between planting and being ready to harvest. So I usually speed the time up. Let's run over this out here and see if it makes it. Yeah, that, that'll work. Makes it go away. I don't like leaving stuff like that laying out. I don't know. I guess I'm just weird. There we go. We got rid of that extra straw laying around or whatever that yeah, straw. So there we go. We've got that field harvested. And we are ready to go. This guy's still got a long ways to go. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. And I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you like this, uh, this game, this series. Um, I played it on and off a little bit. Uh, but never really tried to do a series on it, so kind of curious uh, how it's going to play out. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you next time.